Your commentator is Nobbers. Historian Stephen Ambrose once noted that after the war, if he ever heard a veteran speak of another soldier as the bravest man I ever met, he was usually speaking of a medic. In the maelstrom of combat, they selflessly ran from wounded man to wounded man, bringing a chance at life in the midst of scenes where death reigned. The large red cross they wore was supposed to protect them, and enemy forces usually, but not universally, respected that convention. But even aside from the threat of direct enemy fire, being a combat medic was a dangerous assignment. Shell fire and shrapnel drew no distinction between combatants and non-combatants. It was through the efforts of the medics that the odds of wounded soldiers surviving surgery or treatment in the mobile field hospital greatly improved. In some armies, the medics underwent the same training as infantrymen, except for not using weapons. They served in foxholes, advanced with the troops during offensives, and went between lines to attend to the wounded, often at great danger to themselves. After a brief examination, they would apply a tourniquet if needed, inject morphine, clean up the wound and sprinkle sulphur powder on it, put on a bandage and drag the wounded soldier off the field. Some of the equipment used is displayed here. The range demonstrated includes US bandages and medical kits, Commonwealth field dressings and a range of German medical kits as well. Finally, one cannot embark on a war campaign who had the odd venereal disease or two, and we can thank the medics for the kit to treat that as well. In Hell Let Loose, as in the real world of warfighting, a medic is therefore a force multiplier, as I have stated in previous videos. But what does this translate to for the average gamer? Well, in the imagery you can see here, I'm waiting for a medic to come and revive me. Nervous. Medic. Yeah. You're going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way. Down where the lap boy is. Oh yeah, he got me. Oh. You need to put smoke up there. It's quite a common thing for this game. You get shot and you see the hope of salvation somewhere nearby, marked in meters distance from you. And when that distance starts to shrink, you know that there is a chance that you won't have to respawn and perhaps run half a kilometer back to the fight. Within a few seconds, you're back into it and your squad or team hasn't lost any ground because you're still there fighting. Copy that, thank you. Thanks, mate. So, how to medic then? The key is to have good situational awareness and as much as possible to make sure you focus on the revive markers that appear on your screen. Further, you need to have an understanding on where the enemy might be. I mean, after all, the people you're going to revive were just shot or grenaded or whatever. So there's probably a few bad guys nearby. That's why we medics get smoke. I'll heal you as soon as I raise you, mate. Okay, thank you. The medic gets a rifle, pistol, smoke grenades, morphine ampule and a whole bunch of bandages. And we get to run. A lot. Sometimes we're too late to help. I'm sorry. 
Other times we fight our way to our patients. Got him. Sorry, hang on. I had to kill. When you come back in, just push up close to the um, Grand Suk and um, get some I'll see if you do down uh, if you heals as well, mate. Just a sec. Yep. Yeah, I got it. Just keep cover me. down for a fucking moment. Come me to north, but yeah, I'm keeping my Most times it's pretty damn dangerous where we work, but it makes a difference. My endorsing you, coconut. You're already 100. <laughs> oh, well, I forgot again. God damn it. Yeah, okay, but it helps with the roll. Yeah, mate, I'm coming. Sure, Jax. <laughs> Stay down, soldier. Okay, finished, is it? Yeah, man. It's about one minute till the amount. We'll catch us all tomorrow. Good night, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me where it hurts, mate. I just yeah. got full. I'll heal I'll you as well. Like five minutes. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Yeah, it's I'm coming. Keep me covered, boys. Keep me covered. Here's your heal, mate. I'm coming, lads. I'm coming. As I said before, look around and identify soldiers who need your help. Use terrain to mask your approach. Cover, not concealment so you don't get shot. Smoke is your friend also. Yes, always ask for ammo boxes. You need more smoke grenades, of course. To finish off, I'm going to play a couple of minutes of quick footage here demonstrating how to medic. Sometimes your team are surprised when you're healing them. It's a great thing for morale, though. Yep. Yeah, watch it. Yeah, he's firing out. Thank you. Yeah, I think they're real close. Ah, oh, the commander's going to put down another airhead. Yeah, yeah, we'll do it. Thank you. Let's make it, man. That's... Now I want it. Smart. He, he drops the 
airhead and then drop supplies just near it. So if they don't see one, they'll see the other. Okay, I'll cover you because I'm yeah, just no. Yeah, he just did that. He didn't put it deep enough. Oh, the next oh, tree line, the next tree line, there's um I put the supplies there. I'm gonna tap out, don't worry about it. Just, just run to just, just smoke it. Too dangerous. In the middle of a field. Oh, twats moaning about where they are. They, they were in cover. It just took fucking everyone two okay, hours. Okay, guys, to get uh, new OP down. Let's capture this point. Post over here now, I'm going to get the buddy. Oh, oh no I'm not. I, put, I went all the way over there, I had it for fucking 10 minutes. And no, nobody, not one fucking squad leader would come until they set up. Why wait till they get set up? I, honestly, I tried like three times, couldn't get near your position. Oh, I don't, yeah, no, mate. I meant the Echo Squad, he was there for about 20 minutes. Yeah, and he, I was like, I don't know what he was doing. Got a garrison. Oh my god, Nobbers, you're right next to them. Enemy Gary down. Yep, we got the garrison and we got the outpost. Oh what my god, he's right there. Well done. No, oh fine. my god. Come across the corner. Cover me, I'll bandage him. Yeah, bandage me and I'll cover him. gun just in case the tank comes up the road, maybe. Yep. Did you? I think that's 2G. That is 2G. Yep. 